Hi there. Welcome back. Welcome if you're new. Alright, so we are nearly the, at the end of the month, so I'm just going to go ahead and do a quick flip through of the month of April and just show you guys where we're at. Still loving this cover. Not that I don't love my other one, but this one just, I do really like this cover. <laughs> Um, all right, so let's start in the front. We'll go to our, I did pop these little, I made these a long time ago. I popped those in because I have a hard time kind of finding some of these areas. So I just wanted something, um, that didn't stick out, but was there. Uh, so gonna do our little monthly check-in April was a little harder I did do some spending um, I need to mark a couple of things so you know okay. I bought all that stuff came there I don't think I've spent any this week. Oh, I did Friday was the 28th. Every Friday. <laughs> Every Friday in April. It's okay. Uh, still wasn't too bad. It was, what, five days of spending? Not too bad. I don't... I'm not gonna... <laughs> hate on that too much um, let's see I have gotten I think all of these orders now oh wait nope I did spend where is it um, no I think that was this Friday nope it was Tuesday I bought so six days we spent um, I bought some stuff from sweet quiet designs uh, thread up came um, that and that okay and then what day was it 24 shipped and it was roughly around 50 bucks um couldn't help it <laughs> okay so let's get to april all right so april 1st uh I spent a lot of day that day crafting. It was so beautiful, 81 degrees, and then it got cold again. Um, Kit is from Creating and Co. Uh, these little stickers are from Tipsy Dog Designs. Mm, Sweet Quiet is no, that was Shine Sticker Studio. Um, I'm watching, re-watching Once Upon a Time. I started season three. Let's see, got an Amazon order, Honeybee Shop order, which sadly I didn't use anything. I mean like the Honeybee Shop. So I thought, I'll show you guys what I got. So I got these, so I got this little set of top tabs. So you get like the inbox, which is obviously too big, which I knew that one would be, but these, um, well, that's all scratched up and that's how these came. I haven't even done anything with them. So I wasn't really happy with the quality. I don't, I've only bought from the honeybee shop one other time. You can see how much farther that sticks up than mine back there. And it actually sticks out of the top of the planner and since I throw this in my purse, it just doesn't work for me. So anyway, they just, you know, go in my drawer. So it is what it is. But I love this, how it turned out. The kit, um, this was from the 
sub for um, one um, <laughs> uh, the coffee monsters co man my brain's not working today but uh, yeah so had to pick up some litter make a bank run pay some bills and it rained it was gross but I really like how this one turned out uh, this one was Pookie Bear Cuties, just some journaling kit stuff. That sticker is from Constance and Sweet Kawaii Designs. Uh, this kit is from um, Creating & Co. Just hilarious in my opinion. Um, we had Friday off for Good Friday, so I spent the day kind of... Mm, not doing a whole lot because my stomach was hurting really bad, but I uh, I forgot to film that, didn't I? I never did film that DIY for my reusable sticker book. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry because I did have somebody ask me about that. I thought I filmed it, but yeah, I was going to and I got sick and yeah, I don't think I ever did. I'll have to go back and look. Oh my goodness. Anyway. <laughs> Uh, so I started watching Castle Rock. It's like um, based off of Stephen King created things. It's like the first season was pretty good. It was different. But I haven't really gotten into season two yet. Um, I don't know. It is what it is. But yeah. I'll, I don't know. <laughs> Wasn't my... Like I didn't mind it. I'm not saying that at all. But... Um, I don't know. I just really wasn't compelled to watch the second season. So um, so I didn't feel really good. Uh, this month hasn't been very good for me. Um, I, I don't know. I've been having a lot of feelings <laughs> this month. So I'll get to that in a little bit. Um, so my friend, her dad passed away. Uh, they had the viewing and his funeral on Monday. We were having some issues with our scanner at work. It was quite annoying. Finally, we've gotten that fixed. But, um, but yeah, I didn't, had, didn't feel very good. Um, did some filming, replaced blinds. Uh, so this day I was kind of flattered that everybody emailed upper management they were trying to get me on full-time which it worked I think the following week I started full-time maybe the week after so I did a, f a flip and a low spin check-in I started Ward D which has not been released yet it comes out the 8th if you like Frieda McFadden that book was really good uh, it comes out the 8th of May so check it out it was good um, I love these stickers. They're my favorites from Amazon. Um, stopped by my mom. <laughs> she had an Easter basket for me. <laughs> yes, I am a spoiled brat, which I wrote <laughs> on there. Uh, I finished Word D, so I mean, like, yeah, it literally took me. I don't think I actually got to read much on this day. But I started it here and I finished it here. And I think those were the only two days I really read it. I think I just picked it up and started reading. And then I never actually got to r really read. Yeah, so here I was offered full time and um, got to start the next Monday. So I was very, very happy. This is when I ordered my Freely Noted, the 400 page um, pocket size. Uh, I didn't eat dinner that night. I still wasn't feeling very well. I ordered this cover from Cynthia on the 15th. Um, did a Ulta trip. Went to Home Depot. Went to Publix. Um, I, yeah, I didn't pay for this. Stephen paid for it. So we just had fun day shopping that day. Um, started rewatching Harry Potter. Like I do that every now and then. I didn't, we stopped, I think, on the sixth movie, and I really haven't watched any more. Just a nice, lazy day. I cleaned the bathrooms. Um, so, first day, full time. It was a really long day, I'm not going to lie. Um, it went by fast, but it was a long day. I was tired. <laughs> um, I got my 
orders from SLP. What's SLP? Oh, Sammy Lynn plans. I ordered that so long ago, I forgot about it. Um, it, it took a while. Uh, so that came and my Amazon order came. Uh, I vacuumed, I just cleaned, did some things. Steven started getting sick and he finally is just now getting over it. Like it took him, yeah, two weeks. It was awful. Um, placed my first order with ThreadUp. Not happy. Won't ever order from them again. Just going to say. <laughs> I mean, yeah. One of the shirts, the sizing was definitely not, definitely not correct. I order from that company all the time. I ordered a size bigger than I normally buy because I wasn't really sure how it would fit because it was a button up. I can't even get it on like no it is definitely not the right size and it is the same brand so like you know how some shops sell different brands this is like their brand and I have several shirts and I know things can fluctuate a little bit but that's not the only issue so most of the things that I bought were new with tags um, one of them said new without tags and it was really really picked up like it had picks all down the front of it and then the sweater that I bought which I was like I was like okay whatever I'll deal with it because the sweater that I bought I absolutely loved and a loan from the company brand new would have been more than I paid for the whole order from ThreadUp but the sweater stinks and I can't get the smell out of it. It smells like mildew. I don't know if they washed it and then just let it set or I don't know, but it, it smells so bad. And I've washed it several times at this point. And uh, yeah, so I'm not happy. So three of the items out of the five and the other two, I just really don't care for. And it, it's pointless to return them because I'm only going to get about half of my money back and I'm not doing that. I'll resell this stuff. Well, the stuff that's new with tags on it, I'll resell that stuff and hope that I can recoup a little bit of my money. I'm not, I mean, I'm going to keep working on the sweater because that's really what I wanted and I really, really like it. It's real pretty, but it smells bad. So if you have any tips on that, I would gladly take them. Um, yeah, so I won't ever order from them again. I will just go buy my clothes new. <laughs> Much better. <laughs> um, my Amazon order came. My Portland Leather Goods wallet. I love that wallet. It's beautiful. Finally got around to change my shower head. Um, so I started back on uh, intermittent fasting. It's where you only eat for a certain portion of the day. Um, I mean, I've only been doing it for about a week, uh, week and a half. I don't know how it's going. I haven't really seen much movement on the scale. And the last time I lost quite a bit of weight pretty quick. So I don't know if maybe it's the hours that I chose or what. But anyway, I don't know. I've had a lot of stress going on the last, we're getting into that now. The last couple of weeks have been pretty rough. So my son, Christian, he was working at Staples. He quit. So um, he's now unemployed. He is 20, almost 24 years old. He hasn't worked for the entirety of his life. He worked for a few years at Food City while he was in high school. And then he quit. And he never got a job again until last year in April when he started working at Staples and he has no drive and it's driving me crazy. So that really kind of, I don't know, uh, stressed me out. And so you'll notice that I really didn't plan. Um, I just kind of wrote things down and threw stickers in until we got to here. These days, I was just kind of done. So 
this was already set up. Um, I just kind of made a note uh, here Friday. I went to work. I came home and I laid down and I literally did not want to talk to anybody. I didn't. It's hard when you have a child. So I live with my boyfriend and my child lives with us. He is not my child's father. So I get his point of not wanting to support a grown adult who is not participating in anything. He doesn't help clean. He doesn't help take care of anything around the house. And now he's not working. So he's sitting around doing absolutely nothing, you know, living off of us. He does help out with the bills, but when that money's gone, then he won't be able to help out anymore. So, um, so I get Steven's point of view where he gets upset, but this is also my child that I would never put out on the street or I would never force him to do anything. I mean, if he can't pay me, he can't pay me. If he lives in my, you know, my extra bedroom for the rest of his life, there's nothing I'm going to do. But from a mom's perspective, I want him to be productive and I also want him to be able to support himself should something happen to me because that's inevitable. One day I'm not going to be here and more than likely it's going to be before he's not here. So, um, I don't know how to get it through his head that he needs to be able to support himself in case something happens to me. So I've been a little stressed out about that and I just, I just wanted to be done. I just wanted to be done with life and with things and I was struggling really hard. I think I was starting to come down with what Steven had. I obviously didn't get it to the extent that he did. I don't feel bad. I wasn't feeling well. Uh, I kind of slept off and on but yeah the stress of Christian and not feeling well I just didn't care. I didn't want to get out of bed. Um, still I got up, did laundry and I'm pretty sure I pulled a muscle in my back. I don't know if I slept wrong. It's finally worked its way out. I'm fine now, but yeah, it was just a whole bad weekend. <laughs> Monday, went to work, finally. You know, I mean, like being out of the house helps a lot, but um, got my paper bound creations cover and I absolutely love it. Uh, my planner monkey coat order. Sweet Quiet Designs order, and then Oils and Harmony. I buy from them just, it's like body oil. I absolutely love them. They smell so good. Uh, so I spent most of the day out to a client, kind of helped me keep my mind off of things. And then I filmed some videos around these. Had planned pork chops for dinner, but I didn't feel like cooking, so we had pizza. Um, didn't, you know, another, it was just like basically worked. I didn't really, what's wrong with that sticker? I think it's like folded up on itself. There we go. Okay. Um, so yeah, I just kind of threw some stickers down. Uh, it was admin day. Michelle is our branch manager, came in. She wanted to look at the new space that we're looking at renting for our office, which I think we're gonna get it. Um, but she came in and it was nice. I did take a nap when I got home. I was exhausted. Watched some YouTube videos and just kind of had a nice relaxing evening. Uh, Thursday, worked. Um, we had a work lunch with Michelle. It was really nice. Then I had a meeting afterwards. But I have seriously been waiting for this weekend because I have been exhausted. Um, and then... <laughs> I'm so dumb. So I was like, oh, what did we have for dinner? Cheese steak. And how did I spell it? The wrong way. And I was like, yeah, I can't spell and I'm not fixing it. I don't care. <laughs> so it is what it is. 
We had our 30 year celebration at work. Got my Amazon order of just some little booty socks. I love them. Um, caught up on some YouTube and uh, they had the soap at Bath and Body Works was like $2.95. I think it's still on until like Monday. So I don't know when this video is going up. It might be Monday when it goes up. So it might not be on sale anymore, but they had, yeah, soaps for $2.95. And I was like, yes, very much. So I bought nine. Actually, I bought, let me tell you. <laughs> so I placed an order and I just pick everything up in the store. It's easier. So I placed an order, clicked pick it up in the store, hit the Apple Pay, boom, my order's placed. And I go look at it and I'm like, huh? And it was to North Carolina. I'm very much not in North Carolina. So then I had to go place another order for our store. Pick up, at least it wasn't being shipped. So the order will just fall off. I called them to ask and they said it would fall off in about five days and they just released my money back to me. But I was like, are you serious? I can't believe I did that. I'm so silly. But yeah, it was funny. So I got that, went and picked that up after work and we had chicken and dumplings for dinner. And then today is Saturday. I just went ahead and filmed because, um, I knew I probably wouldn't be able to tomorrow. I don't know, actually I probably could, but I wanted to go ahead and get it filmed today since Christian's not here, he went out with his friends. So it's easier for me to film when he's not here. He's loud and you can hear him even though he's got his door shut and I'm downstairs, you can still hear him. But we went to Monterey's for my mom for her birthday. Her birthday was actually the seventh, but we just celebrated because my family we have an uncle in Vegas who's not doing so well and so some of my family has traveled out there to see him and they just got back so my mom wanted to wait until all of that was done and uh, so we celebrated today it was a nice dinner or lunch we had a good time and tomorrow I intend to really do not much of anything except for maybe editing some videos and playing some games. I think I want to start playing uh, Zelda Breath of the Wild so I can get caught up for the new one when it comes out What in a week or two. Um, I want to go ahead and play that. So probably do that and then we will start our work week. So that is April. It was kind of long and obnoxious. And I'm sorry, but that is what's going on. So um, I can't think of anything else really going on right now, but uh, it's been an interesting month so far. So if you like this video, don't forget to give it a like and it would mean the absolute world to me if you consider subscribing and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.